Guten Tag, and welcome back to the Fritz Carlton. We're in the new MOB fabrication shop, and uh, on today's episode of the Fritz Carlton, I uh, dig up and till a new plant garden on the south side of the Carlton, and uh, I go over to Ed and Kim's house where they're finishing up on a new deck. His, uh, Dave is uh, spray painting it and getting it ready. So, and then uh, I throw a little barbecue to celebrate the deck opening up. And then you can see like where the sprinkler line had a root going through it and it suffocated the uh, pipeline. So the deck is finished. Grab a cool tasty beverage and enjoy it. And I'll talk to you at the end of the clip. Get up and uh, do all that stuff up front. So that's the project for now. Keep me busy. Okay, this is the way I'm gonna arrange them in the, uh, the new garden. Got the watermelon in the back, peppers in the middle row, and aroma tomatoes in the front. So I'll put them in there sporadically and see how they look. All right, here's our uh, completed garden. So I got everything in the ground now. I'm almost ready to pack her up and have a happy hour at the first girl. So, got it all on the ground just in time. All right, we didn't have any more torrential rains today or nothing like that, but this is the sunset. Just see uh, the chiffon clouds. It's like the uh, pink, orangish blue. All right, I just got back and you can see uh, Scotty the Gate Master had done the fence complete all the way around. So I'm pretty happy about that. And then on the other side, I'm... I had him put in a screen door. So but I've been checking out the pumpkin patch. It's really taken off. garden I planted before I left. Uh, it's really taken off to you. So I got the full enclosed fence with that garden. There's some peppers on there I'm going to pick later. Alright, we've moved the barbecue over to Kim's house to celebrate the grand opening of her new deck. Just going through the final stages. And what do you got to do? Seal coat it? Yeah. Waterproof on, here. waterproof on the top of it so that'll be off limits and then we'll move the barbecue over here tonight's menu we got some chicken some corn on the cob red skin potatoes and a melange and uh, some kind of pork roast loin sirloin beef or something so we'll see how uh, we can cook up some good food and kick back and hopefully not damage the deck in any way or get in any hamper or any efforts of Dave's progress you know because he's almost done all right, you can clearly see this grill has been neglected with all the spider webs and shit on here. So we'll have to give it like a quick once over, get out the wire brush and uh, get the barbecue underway. Deckage is really rolling around pretty quick. It's already halfway done with it and I got successfully got the barbecuer from over there in that location and was able to navigate it through all the scrap pilings there in this little rock garden here that I kind of tore up a little bit but at least we got the grill going and <clears throat> we can wait till the coals get nice and white. I took care of the uh, the cobweb situation and we're well underway but I have to do some more chores over here like move the table. Don't do that by yourself you hurt your back I'll help you out in a second. Oh, don't be afraid to ask for help. Learn from other people's mistakes. Yeah. You're probably not going to live long enough to make them all yourself. Okay, we got the first round of uh, our uh, pot roast going on here first, and then we'll bring up the next stage. We got our marinade in here. We'll just slowly taste it as it cooks. Nice technique. You really nailed that one. Who is that? Okay, this is like a 
sprinkler hose that got entrapped by a root. And I had to take it up and replace it because the root wanted so much water. It just strangled the, the sprinkler system, which cut off all the pressure from uh, the rest of the system. So he had to go out and cut the whole thing in there. But you run into these problems all the time. And here's like the shrapnel from the deckage and then the new deck that we can't go on yet. But the barbecue is like going in full bloom. Just do some chicken on and stuff. So it's really starting to turn into a real shindig. But yeah, I mean, like, it's just perfect. Just the way the whole pipe is just engulfed by the, the root. So, you run into these problems, like, I don't know what the odds are, but, you know, it's just great to be a part of it. Part of the madness. We're hitting at like uh, 300 degrees, a little over. 300. We got the chicken now and some corn on, so now we're starting to get the, the full value of the barbecue. There's a little extra uh, save. Ooh, I almost lost the grill. A little savory extra. Stay tuned. So uh, the solar powered lights are coming on. The deck is ready. We can walk on it now. And then uh, we've got a shrapnel. Blue spruce. And the other grill over there. So. Alright, here's the nighttime deckage. It's good to walk on now. So we got the barbecue almost uh, done. All right, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. As, uh, I get the new garden going over and the fence gets made over at the Carlton and then we travel over to Kim's house where Dave is putting a coat on the new deck, finishing it up and uh, actually I throw a barbecue to celebrate it. So uh, I hope you've enjoyed all the clips. Uh, subscribe to Too Easy Fritz, Drive Safe, and Alveda scene from the Fritz Carlton.